now <laughs> you are driving christmas because you're the one that's going to spend money hi my loves welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here hi my name is ibidonia shaw and it's vlogmas day energy 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 hey okay so if you're wondering why i'm here that's because we're about to do a mukbang i'm sure you can tell from the title we're going to be eating okay i have food here i have cup and water we're going to be eating and we're also going to be doing the christmas tag so this is going to be doubling as a mukbang if you don't know what a mukbang is i'm going to be eating and i'm going to be answering the questions i want to go deep into this because first of all i'm hungry okay but also because I can't wait to answer the questions. This tag has 20 questions. So the questions revolve around Christmas and I cannot wait to answer them. So without further ado guys, let's get it. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. A jingle bell swing and jingle bells ring. All right, um, so let me lay out my food. So the first thing is we're going to be pouring the water. Guys, I kept pouring this water until now so that you guys will actually believe that it's water I'm drinking. That I did not go and find one whitish champagne and I come and lie to you people that it's water. I got this food from Food Court. It's not sponsored, guys. I just, um, I really like their food from a particular place in food court if a particular vendor so i've had their food oh, um once and i liked it so i wanted to have it again while doing this mukbang so i have here shawarma chips burger and water okay so um i'm going to take the very first question before i start eating. so the very first question says what is your favorite christmas movie i'll say that my favorite christmas movie is home alone okay so let, let me give you guys classification right i have old and i have modern slash new okay old is home alone new is christmas princess switch i absolutely see i feel like for me the first part of home alone did it the other part i wasn't really feeling it anymore you know the very first part of home alone was all i needed and then first of all guys i mixed up my order okay it's shawarma chicken and chips so yeah so the second um the more modern um version of christmas movies that i love is the princess switch that has three parts my favorite part is the first okay maybe like the first two let me say the first two. Second question says are you on the naughty list or the nice list let me have you bite on my chicken what did you say no once don't worry i'm coming wait for me i'm coming here yeah? let me tell you something i feel like i'm going to get lost in this food mm. if there's anything as the in-between list i think i'm on the in-between because i'm not gonna lie i'm a shadow of god on some days and i'm a shadow of god on the other days i'm not a shadow of the devil so yeah i should be on the nice list abby santa claus right yeah thank you very much third question <laughs> Third question is funny. Third question says, show us an embarrassing Christmas photo. Well, I'm sorry. I'm too cute to be embarrassed. Okay? So even if I have an embarrassing Christmas photo, you thought I was going to share it with you? You thought I was following you enough to share it with you? Yeah, in the long thing. Moving forward. Question four says, have you ever had a white Christmas? Um, mm -mm. For my knowledge of what a white Christmas is, that's um, Christmas that has like a lot of snow falling. I live in Nigeria. It's hot. It's usually hot over here. Our our estimate of snow is Hamatan. So no. Um. Next question says, do you start your Christmas shopping on Black Friday or wait till the last minute? Hmm. hmm. I shop on Black Friday. Like this year, for example, I bought some things on Black Friday already. I don't like last minute shopping because I feel like it gets you in a frenzy. So no. My answer to that is, I'm a Black Friday shopper. Shop early. Shop once and for all, and have peace of mind. Next question says, chicken wings. If you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? Um, I think a Christmas movie that has really stuck to my... So, first of all, guys, I love, love, love Christmas. Okay? Starting from, like, Christmas... I have a Christmas playlist. 
So I have Christmas playlists in movies and in music, okay? So starting from like, you know, listening to the songs that just put you in the Christmassy mood to movies, I absolutely freaking really love Christmas. So I feel like the movie that I'd love to be would be Operation Christmas Drop. It's on Netflix. Um, It's a Christmas movie that basically, essentially is the message behind the movie that I love, right? Which is, it's Christmas time, so care for people, look out for other people, give to people that can't afford, you know? And honestly, I don't think you have to wait till Christmas, but if you'd rather wait till Christmas, then please use Christmas as the reason why you take care of other people. Next person says, when does your family put up your Christmas tree and decorate it? So I'm an adult now, and in Nigeria, there's a song we sing, adults would not stop me better. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Because let me tell you, when I was young, Christmas was the schnitz, okay? Now, <laughs> you are dreading Christmas because you're the one that's going to spend money. However, um, I used to look forward to putting up Christmas trees because when I was growing up, me and my mom, well, mostly me, but like me and my mom, we used to put up our Christmas tree at the beginning of December. So, what's kids at the first week in December, we had this big, huge Christmas tree and we had all the decorations, all. I'm saying like the wrath. The, the the red bottom ribbon that says Merry Christmas, like name it. Okay, we had different different types of you know Christmas decorations. So we always make sure to put it up by like the first week in December. We felt like before December, I'm already prepping now. She's already going to bring everything out. So I'm not gonna lie, I feel like I low key miss that because you know <laughs> I'm an adult now. I'm an adult now, and I don't remember the last time I put up a Christmas tree. Next question says name all of Santa's reindeer. So like I said, I'm a Christmas girl. I know. Santa has 12, but I don't know all 12. So I'm just going to name the ones I know. Cupid, Comet, Dancer, Prancer, Blitzen, Rudolph. Rudolph. Rudolph because there's a song. Rudolph, Rudolph. That song reminds me of Santa's reindeer. How do I know Santa's reindeer? I love Christmas. <laughs> um, This next question says, is my Christmas tree real or fake? Hello, I live in Nigeria. Our Christmas tree is fake. I think, I do believe, that a few people may have been able to find an original Christmas tree. Okay? But on my own side though, it's fake. Mm. I want to jump over to the shawarma, guys. I'm sorry. This chicken and chips is good, but I've had the shawarma. It's really good. It's from King's Wings, and I have the combo shawarma. Like I said, not sponsored, guys. The shawarma is just really good. The app is called Food Court. Whew. Tell me, are you team eat your shawarma in the wrap or bring it out of the wrap? I'm team take it out the first wrap, the outer wrap, and eat it in the inner wrap. Hmm. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Wait, wait. I love food. Okay. If you're trying to woo me, you're sending me food. I mean, it's not a yes, but you're sending me food. All right, back to the questions. The next question says, picking at gifts or be surprised? Let me tell you, I'm a curious person. Okay. Curiosity, we 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 have me opening up the Christmas gifts the night before, but then I act like I'd not see it. So that when they give me, I'll be like, oh my God, thank you so much. I really like it. I already saw it. Yeah. Next question says, show us your ugly Christmas sweater if you have one. No, I don't have one. Even if I had one, do you think I would have shown you? Um, ooh. Next question says, if you could be under the mistletoe with anyone, who would it be? Let me tell you. Let me tell you. I don't have to think about it. His name is Minyungi, aka Sugar, aka August D. If you don't know who that is, go and find us about it. Forget about it, actually. Next one says, does your family have a special holiday recipe you you like to help make? Um, do we? Did we? Because now I'm an adult. Okay. Did we? I think we did. I think we did. But we used to make this when my grandma was alive. So there's a traditional food that people from a place in Nigeria, the state is called Oshun. The, the, I don't know what to call them, the sub-state is called Ilarogun. The food is called Ekuru. So Ekuru was my grandma's special Christmas recipe. So I'm saying after we've made pounded yam, we've made fried rice, we've made jollof rice, we've made the egusi, my grandma will still ask us to make Ekuru. Ekuru is made out of beans right so it's made out of beans you make some sauce on the side you make some okra and then you mix everything together and oh it is so good i will pick a, a kuru over these or any other modern food i've eaten self or late this food is speaking to me it's delivering messages next question says are you a pro one letter side And with that, we're coming to the end of this video. It's 12 a.m. on the dot, and I'm back. I know I did say that was the end of the video, but they brought the light, okay? So, we're just gonna wrap this up. If you're not, if you're not African, or if you're not Nigerian, yes, we buy power here, but they still carry the light, okay? And we cannot really ask them questions. So, uh, moving forward to the next question. Let me let me confess, okay? I already ate my food. It's just I still have some bits of the shawarma, and I have 
um, some chicken left so I'm just gonna finish the video with that um the next question says are you a pro present rapper or do you fail miserably quite honestly I used to be a pro present rapper but I haven't wrapped presents in years I want to wrap a present soon for a friend of mine whose birthday is close by well I'm doubting myself okay even before wrapping the present next question says do you make new year resolutions and do you stick to them quite honestly guys um i think the new name for resolutions are goals so yes i still do do i stick to them fairly i'm using the word fairly because um a lot of times you're not able to, to do everything you plan out to do at the beginning of the year but what matters is you being able to like measure your growth and like, where you get into so then next question says have you ever gone christmas caroling i think that means i've ever gone to a christmas carol yes i've ever gone to sing to people no <laughs> no um what tops your tree hmm. two things used to top our trees when i was a child we used to have a star and we used to have a wreath so some christmases we use the star some christmases we use the wreath the last question says you have been granted one christmas wish what will it be um I feel like my one Christmas wish, honestly, would be that God should never leave or forsake me. I honestly believe that whoever God is backing, whoever God is supporting, no matter what life throws at you, no matter what mistakes you make, no matter um, what happens to you. If you're favored by God, you're favored by God. If you're loved by God, you're loved by God. If you're, um, I mean, you're Christian for you to be watching this. I'm sure you know that in the Bible, there are people, there were people that, according to human standards, societal standards, they were not good enough. But God still chose them and God still loved them. So that's my Christmas wish that I'll become one of those people that God will just love so immensely and, you know, that He'll never leave or forsake me. And if I'm allowed to add Jara, that I'll always be happy. Yeah, so we have come to the end of today's video. I did not finish my food. Yay! I'm proud of myself. Yeah, I think I am proud of myself. Before I see you guys in my next video, remember to be good to yourself and be kind to others. I love you guys so much. I'm in the spirit of Christmas. I will finish this food. I'm not happy with PHCN, but what can I do? I'll finish this food. And then I'll edit the vlogmas that is going up next. And then I'll see you guys in vlogmas day five. Okay? Per. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell.